You have probably received similar email from us with the firmware update. Download the firmware archive with the firmware update from the email. We are going to update Carscope Viso with the current firmware version 1.18. Now extract the contents of the archive and find the firmware update folder. Open it and copy the file inside. Now copy the file inside. Now we're going to connect a Carscope Viso to the laptop and turn it on. Uh, from the main menu, uh, click on data management icon and wait until the connection is established. You will see Viso as an external memory. Open the Viso memory and find the firmware update folder. You can delete all files with SUF extension inside if you want. We decide not to delete the, the other firmware update now. Uh, now we have to paste the previously copied file in this folder. This is the file with the new firmware. Now we close uh, this window and we're going one step backwards to the to the settings menu of Carscope Viso and then select we have to select firmware update. Now we have to click on the file with the newest firmware, which in our case is this one, and agree with yes. And the firmware update process has been started. At the end, we should see this message confirming that the firmware update has been successfully done and that's all. Uh, from the firmware update menu, uh, we can check, check when clicking about that the firmware has been successfully updated to the newer version, in this case 1.18. And that's all.